Did y'all see that freaky nasty stuff that Island Boys just did on the internet that got everybody losing their minds? Look man, I've been trying to tell y'all that the music industry is one of the wildest weird old places on planet earth. We are going to dig into and I got some information right here and we've done some research on what is going on with the Island Boys because you know most people haven't even heard of these guys since 2020 after they fell off with their little hit, I'm an Island Boy. I'm an Island Boy and I've been trying to make Oh, I'm an island boy. Hey, Let's yeah. cut the shit off, bro. I gotta cut the shit the fuck off. But their manager is coming out right now and have given some damning details saying that the island boys, the reason why they may be doing OnlyFans, doing some homo activities on the internet right now, is because them boys may have went from blowing up to their money slowing up. We gonna show y'all what's really going on and how everything is tying into what's going on in the hip hop industry right now and why you seeing all these rappers running around acting like girls. Hell no! Get the hell out! Y'all already know what to do. Like, share, subscribe, let's go. The Island Boys is out here kissing each other on some incest type stuff. You gotta wonder, what the hell is going on in the music industry to where Drake is painting his nails, dudes is running around wearing purses. What happened to today's rappers and all this weird that's going on? And right now we have the data. Let me tell you right now, statistics are showing that hip hop music is on a decline, unfortunately, in 2023. As Billboard has already stated that absolutely no rap albums has charted number one on the Billboard charts. And right now, Taylor Swift and all these pop stars are dominating the music industry. Bruh. Hey yo, what the fuck? And rap music. If the rappers don't get it together, rap music may be a thing of the past, according to this data right here. At the halfway point of 2023 approaches, hip hop has yet to grace the top of either of the Billboard Hot 100. Whenever you see rappers start acting weird on the internet, you gotta follow the money to see what's going on for these weird behaviors. Look, I keep telling these rappers, it's important to invest your money because nobody can be hot forever. And clearly, the Island Boys are no longer hot. And look at them kissing on each other. What the hell is this? I get low. Huh? Whoa, 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 hey, hey, hey. And hip hop is not making as much money as it used to be. So when you look at rappers and artists like the Island Boys, they not touring nowhere. They done messed up their reputation, beefing with the whole music industry. And a lot of people not rocking with them on the industry side. Else is going to check in. You want to check in before you come to this city? You got to check in with me, nigga. I'm everywhere. So where are they going to make their money from when you really think about it? They can't do shows. Who's really buying their records? There was only nothing else they could do but the damn near sell their ass on OnlyFans. And I hate to say this, man. Look, I have no problem or no issues with the Island Boys, but man, truth is truth and whack is whack. And that shit is whack right there, bro. These are brothers, ladies and gentlemen. Two blood brothers kissing on camera, trying to go viral just to stay relevant. And this is what's going on with the rappers in 2023. If Lil Baby ain't charting, if Gunna ain't charting, what you think the Island Boys is making out here in these rap streets? Let's take a look at the data because Look, it says right here, when I did my research, it says the Island Boys in their heyday made up to $2 million from YouTube, TikTok, and Cameo. It also says here, the Island Boys charged up to $600 for business bookings and $215 for personal video shout out requests. But look, their manager says that that money done dried up. They owe me about like $150,000. From what? Your percentage of the Cameo money? Yeah. Is that the only money they're bringing in? Mostly, maybe a little bit on TikTok, but I mean, it's pretty much run dry at this point. Damn! <laughs> when it comes to TikTok, though the Island Boys have millions of followers on TikTok, it's reported here with TikTok paying on an average of three cents, only three cents per 1,000 views. Three cents. The duo could earn on average, allegedly, only $66 monthly. No, not 66,000. $66 a month from a TikTok. I don't think you have the facilities for that big man. Listen, man, TikTok don't make no money, not monetarily. The only way that people are even making, creators even making money on TikTok is through sponsorships. And if the music industry ain't effing with you, you ain't gonna get no sponsorships. So it makes sense why these dudes are kissing each other on camera, trying to get views and potentially doing sex exapades on OnlyFans. But listen, their manager has stated by his own testimony that he caught the Island Boys on some homo type stuff in the bathroom together. So what we seeing right now is not the first time 
Them boys may have been hugging and kissing on each other. Roll the footage. I was like knocking on the door and I'm like, yo, open up the door. Like, nah, bro, like you can't open the door. So I opened the door with a credit card. I got in the room and they was in the bathroom, bro. I opened the door, bro, like both their pants are down. No. What? You heard it from his manager's mouth. You would say it's a rumor, but look, they on the internet doing this. Hold up. What the hell? Oh, 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 Come on, yeah, dude. What the fuck? What the hell is this? Are you out of your mind right now? These guys are blood brothers. What type of Game of Thrones incest type of shit is this? More pictures of them kissing, dog. Come on, bro. Oh, that, this dude got his whole meat out on his. Shit's getting weird. Really, nigga? Yeah, come on. Keep that freaky shit on your paper. Listen, man. Fame is one hell of a drug. These rappers better start getting together, start opening businesses, opening restaurants like Lil Baby did. You see Lil Baby just opened a new restaurant. Look, y'all gotta do something to keep that money coming in when it dry out so that you ain't on OnlyFans selling your ass and kissing your brother in the mouth like this. As a straight male, even if they was joking, how do you play on some gay shit with your blood brother and then say you playing? Don't nobody play like that. Especially with their own family. The internet keeps getting weirder and weirder. There's more stories I gotta bring to y'all. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. If you learned something from this video, make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel. But man, look, the music industry is not what y'all think it was. I'm gone.